Welcome back to the show, you guys. And now it is time for Unfiltered. This is the part of the show where we highlight a featured guest and talk about all of the things that they have going on. Now, today's guest is an award-winning edutainer and has redefined the definition of an international spirits ambassador. He is an ex-professional basketball player in the UK, an international recording artist, and has now established himself as the world's only recognized global ambassador for the rum category. He has conducted master classes on seven continents, and check this out, was voted the 10th most influential person in the world drinks industry by Drinks International. You guys, please welcome to our show, Mr. Ian Burrell. Woo! Ian, my brother. Woo! Welcome Welcome. to the show. (laughs) Yo. Nice to have you. Thank you, (laughs) man. Right off the bat, man, congrats on all your success as an athlete and as now a global ambassador. But I got to ask right off the bat, brother. How did you go from being a professional athlete to a rum ambassador? How did you make that transition? <laughs> <laughs> well, it, you, have, you have to put it in context. Uh, here in the UK, basketball is not as big as it is in the, in the US. So, um, so I, it, although I played for my country and uh, I played uh, to a high level over here, it didn't pay you enough money um, to actually uh, really live the lifestyle you wanted to, to live. So uh, while I was doing that, I was also in the in the spirits game, in the spirits industry. I love rum. Um, it's in my blood as a Jamaican. And uh, I just felt what's what I really wanted to talk. Nice, nice, nice. Yeah. I wanted to talk about that and promote that. Yeah, so that's, that, that's where you see me today. Yeah. I identify. I, I'm, it's also in the blood. <laughs> Look, rum is the cure for everything, right? I second that. That's right. Back home, it cure it. coal, it. everything. everything. <laughs> but of That's course, it. a little bit, a little bit of Yes, listen, even the babies get rum. Y'all give the rum to the babies? No, not to drink, not to drink. Settle, settle down, settle down. So, of course, I, so I, you are the creator of Rum Fest. So, I'm trying to picture in my head what a Rum Fest looks like. What happens? Is it a lot of tasting? Yeah, well, basically. If you, if you if you imagine like a, a beer festival or a wine festival, but just rum in its place. So people come, they get their glass, they go around and sample rums from all over the world. Uh, there are master classes, things, and you really just learn about the rum industry. So uh, that's that's where it, that, that's what a rum fest is. Nice. Wow, there's master classes. That's interesting. I want to go to one of those. You want to go to yes. rum fest? We're gonna go. We're gonna go. So, okay. so Ian, quick question, a little bit about your background. So, how did you get to the UK from Jamaica? How did how did that happen? I was actually, uh, you know, I was actually born in the UK, but I was born to okay. two Jamaicans. Um, they came over. Um, they came over, one was from Kingston, one was from Maypen in Clarendon. Um, my mom that inside this house is Jamaica, and out there is England. So <laughs> the household was Jamaican. Uh, Jamaican food, we spoke patois. Um, it felt like Jamaica, the heating was always up, because, you know, England can be cold. <laughs> so, uh, but uh, I, I'm back in Jamaica quite often. I do a lot of work um, with a few of the rum companies there and also help with training programs for up and coming bartenders and mixologists. That's nice. awesome. So it. see, that's what I want to get into. So what type, what exactly do you teach at your, um, your trainer classes? So we'll teach uh, everything about rum itself in the production, how it's made, how it's used, whether you use it in a cocktail, whether you use it for food and cooking. We talk about the history of rum, where rum is today and where rum is going in the future. And also the different styles of rums out there, just like wines have different types of nuances and grapes and flavors. We have that in rum. So a Jamaican rum is different from say a rum from and a Puerto Rican rum is different from a rum say from, we teach about the different styles of rums that you can try and taste. Mm, that's interesting. You teach about overproof too, right? The different levels. I know there's different levels that's in it. rum. Yeah, we talk about overproof. You know, as a uh, as Jamaicans, white rum is like uh, this, is um, the water of <laughs> that is listen, that <laughs> the water is of the life is used life. In, in not only for drinking, but you also you that's it. You rub a little bit on if you get a mosquito bite. Rub a bit of oh, rum really? on there. You, can put it on your skin? you use it. What's the word? Yeah. Uh, hmm. 
in birth and in death and so it's part of a ceremonial um, um, spirit. Yeah. I always like to say that rum, especially in Jamaica, is more than a spirit, it's a way of life. Listen, oh. yes, for calls, you rub a little bit on your head, them say, come baby, come baby, go get, go get, the, go get the rum, go get the rum bottle, <laughs> go get the rum bottle. <laughs> so, so Ian, speaking of the different types of rum, how do you tell a good rum from a bad rum? Like what is the, how do you, how do you differentiate the two? Oh, that, that's a, that, see a lot of, I mean, subjective individual because I always like to say there's no such thing as a bad rum just bad okay. rum experiences so when I drink a rum if I like it someone else may not enjoy it um, but what I like to look for in a rum I like to look for balance if it's an age rum uh, a lot of flavor natural spices as opposed to additional spices natural sweetness as opposed to added sugar or added sweetness um, a really good balance of sweet sour bitter and spice um, and a lot of flavor as well and with a younger rum some of the white rums I also want that rum flavor to come through that pungentness with various different styles of cocktails and drinks. So yeah, balance is probably the most important thing when you're analyzing what's a good rum and a bad rum. But most of that is down to personal preference. Ah, gotcha, okay. gotcha, gotcha, All gotcha, right, gotcha. so there's no good and bad rum. I get, I'm <laughs> gonna, I'm gonna remember that the next time I go to a party and I ask for something. <laughs> <laughs> uh, so just give me the rum <laughs> bottle. <laughs> So, so wait, so that's right. I'm going to tell them you told me to say that. <laughs> so, Ian, we got to take a short commercial break. We stick around with us, please. And when we come back, we're going to make some drinks if that's all right. So you guys stay tuned. Welcome back to our holiday special with none other than the rum expert himself, Ian Burrell. But before we even get started, I have to make sure you understand what we're about to do here. But he's going to show us how to make two drinks. We're ready for it. But like I said, we, we, we got to give the disclaimer first. Mm -hmm. Please understand and be aware that this next segment is intended for adults only over the age of 21. We do not condone, endorse, or recommend drinking alcohol at any time. Please be responsible. So, Ian, welcome back. Hey. Welcome back. I feel like... I feel like I'm supposed to have some music, yeah, yeah, yeah. but listen, <laughs> but it's in my oh. head. It's in my head. <laughs> so today you're going to show us how to make two drinks. So the first one is the Santa Rita and the second yeah. is the Sorrel Royal Daiquiri. Okay, so we're in your hands. Let's wow. go. That's, nah, that's, a, that's, a lot, that's a lot on me. Yeah. So, okay, so we're going <laughs> to... This is going to be the first time we're doing a cocktail here from the UK and you guys in the States. So it is going to be amazing. So we're going to start okay. off with the Santa Rita, uh, okay. which is like a twist on the margarita. So first of all, you get your, uh, your cocktail shaker. Make sure you got your shaker there because it's going to be a shaken cocktail. Uh, open it up. Have that ready. Uh, take the lid off. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> right, Why can't Chris, go on. get the lid off? Why I can't get it off? <laughs> Somebody, somebody yeah, said, you put this on with gorilla glue. What y'all do? Let's move on. Get the, get the... Oh, there, go, 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 there, Okay, right. Inside the shaker, we're going to add like two ounces of just like a, a tequila. So tequila blanco, because this is based on a margarita. So uh, tequila. Oh, I hear you. me. Two ounces. Two ah. Just two ounces. Um, we have heavy hat. Oh, in a the shaker. <laughs> hey, where the shaker there? It's right in front of you. Oh, okay, let's go. Candace, come on now. Look. <laughs> oh, I can't come. Let's go. We go. Right, this is right. going fast. Now, let's... now you're going to add what's called one ounce of freshly squeezed lime. So you can actually squeeze, you can squeeze the lime, which is probably about um, uh, a whole lime. So uh, just one ounce. I've got my little lime squeezer here. So. Please. Mine's is easy. Let, let, let me help you out, Ken. Hold on, let me help you out. Yes. So if you're doing, if you got, if you got like, you got lime wedges there, I would do about, uh, I would do about six wine, lime wedges. Okay. Oh, six. Okay. All right, boom. Yeah. Just 
One, two, three, Squeeze four, that all five. in. I got it. Oh, you got We're the last good. one. Right. Yep. What's next? Okay, and then we want to also get a little bit of sweetness inside there. So what we're going to do to add to this, we're going to add uh, some coconut cream, cream of coconut. And we're just going to add Boom. like half an ounce of that. Half an ounce, okay. You got to move Chris because, you know, time runs out fast. Okay. Okay, that's time. All right, boom, boom, boom. Yeah, and then we're going to do, uh, oh, that was it, that was it. <laughs> oh, and then we're going to do like a, an ounce of lychee juice. Ah. Uh, boom, that's it, okay. Okay. Add some ice into there. <laughs> we there, we there. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay. Add some ice. You've had some ice in your shaker? We got yes. ice. Give it a good shake now. Give it a good shake. Put, Put the lid back on. on. Remember, you have to take the shake. lid back on. Don't put it on. Right. There you go. Shake, shake, shake. Oh, shake, shake, shake. shake. Oh, shake, shake, shake. So I got that. Bartender. All right, let me get... All right, cool. Whoa, give, it... oh. give me that. How you doing it? Show me how to shake. Shake. <laughs> there you go. Yeah, that's it. Oh, I was nice too shaker. rough with the shaker. Okay, my bad. <laughs> yeah, give it some room. Uh, okay. And now we taste. Okay. Right, then we're gonna add just a touch of sorrel liqueur just inside the inside our glass. Just in the bottom. Oh, in the glass, so, in the glass. Which glass? Inside our, our martini glass or our stem cocktail glass, any glass, the glass that you actually have in your hand there. The that one, the, the, let, that one, can yeah. I let me pour for you? Let me pour for you. I'm not doing much. Just, Dang, just a little that was a heavy hand. Yeah. <laughs> she real heavy hand. She's trying oh, to... Give me. Oh, yeah. Okay. All right. right so now we're ready to. Our, our shaking cocktails can be poured on top of that into the glass. All right. Pour, 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 pour. Oh, Chris, yeah. Chris, your one might be a little bit sweet. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. That's all you gonna give me, can I? Mm -mm. Let me taste. All right. <laughs> you want me to wait on you to that. taste it? I can taste it. Ooh, all right, I, here we go. Okay, Cheers. we gotta hurry up. So we. Cheers. Here we go. Cheers, it. Cheers. Oh yeah. Cheers. <laughs> That's good. I'm gonna have to make this drink when I have a little company. Okay, so let's do the next one. We're gonna save that for <laughs> after the show. All right, all right. Next know, one. Next got... one. So being a rum ambassador, we're gonna have to use some rum. So we're using two ounces of the Equiano African Caribbean rum. Okay. Into our shaker, back into our shaker. All right. Thank oh, and you. thank you for sending the rum to us, Ian. We appreciate that. Oh, no problem, no problem. I hope you enjoy it. It's one of the best in the world. <laughs> and then we're gonna add one ounce of the sorrel liqueur. I've actually made my own sorrel, but you actually have a, a great alternative there, one of the best sorrel liqueurs out there. One ounce? How much? Is, so like half? Uh -huh. One ounce. Not like that. I know in the state, I know in the state you say sorrel, we call it sorrel in Jamaica. Sorrel, right. And sorrel. listen, we we have our sorrel okay. here so that people understand oh, what it wow, looks yeah, like yeah. too. Okay. You know, this so the Jamaicans say, I have mine, you have yours. So cheers to the sorrel. Cheers to the sorrel. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, Good. next. Okay, so that's going to be our sweetness there. We're going to add a little bit more lime. So we're going to add another um, squeeze of lime. We're going to add basically a whole lime or four of your wedges. So okay. maybe me two. Lime How many you got left? Squeezy. You can't. You struggle with your lime. Hold on. <laughs> that's why I'm using a, I'm using a, a, a <laughs> lime squeeze. <laughs> uh, ah! Okay, that's, next, that's the third. So, next one more time, we're gonna be smart and do that too. <laughs> so, this three, this four, this make four. Okay, boom, 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 boom. Okay, what's next? Four. All right, add some ice, lots of ice in there. You got it's that in there. You got more ice, add some more ice because this should be a nice cold drink, and then you're gonna it's give it a shake. Cold. It's cold. We got the got ice. It. Okay, let's, let's shake. give it a good shake. Really good Let me shake, shake again. Are you shake the last one? You shake, you shake sh it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, make sure the top is on. So, it's a I want to participate. Give me a shake too. Give me a little Jamaican rhythm. Boom, 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 boom. Shake it like this. <laughs> <laughs> Mine don't even got, got a top on. I got to put the top on. There you go. Okay. All right, all right, all right. Okay. Voila. We're going to strain that back into our glass. Oh, yeah. Leaving enough space for some champagne on top. Ooh. Ooh. Champagne. All right, all right, okay. all right. All right. Champagne. Boom, boom, boom. Gonna... How much champagne? Just how much we put on there, Ian? As much as you need. Say this. <laughs> all right. Uh. This, is, this is one of those drinks oh, that you uh. need. 
There you go. Oh, okay. Woo! All right. All right. Great, great Christmas cocktail for the holiday season. And then you sip oh. and savor. Happy yeah. holidays. Yeah. Cheers. Happy holidays. Yeah. Cheers, Ian. Right, let me get a little sip of shit. Ooh. Ooh. Is that what it... I can't even do that. That's a serious <laughs> drink. That is for mature audiences. Yes. Only. <laughs> yes. Very, very mature. <laughs> that will warm your socks. So. <laughs> your toes will curl. Oh, yeah. Listen, <clears throat> you're good. You're good. I cannot believe that I learned how to do this. I've oh, never see. known how to properly use this thing. I think I'm ready to be a bartender. I think I, I think I'm ready. I don't think I'm ready for a bartender <laughs> status. I'm ready. But I have learned so much. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So much. And it is an honor and a privilege having you here with us today. Thank you. Once Ian. again, thank, thank you, Ian. Thank you, thank you, our audience. What a treat this was. Remember, we don't endorse or condone any yeah. type of alcoholic nope. beverages for minors. What a great show. Happy holidays. Happy holidays to you, Ian. We want to hear from you. Remember <laughs> to connect, to stay with us, to stay in tune. And as we leave, we leave on that note. How can the people connect with us? Connect with us on at Candice and Chris Live. There you have it. Happy Cheers. Holidays. Cheers. Ian. See you next time. Yeah. <laughs>